This is what I walk into. Hey, Griffin. A little gray hair behind me. It's tough, you know, I'm balding, but I'm not gray. Right, cut that, please. All right, so today, Joel is super busy, so she wants me to do a day in my life. It's gonna be very interesting. Yeah, so financial advisor, it's, today is Thursday the 9th. Pretty easy day for me today, actually. I need to make some phone calls. I need to get two more applications sent out to clients. I have a big call at noon. I'm getting applications started here. I'll go down and show you how I make coffee. I have baseball practice at six. I also coach baseball at IUP. Played a cow, cow and IUP are rivals, so it's kind of funny how that all went down, but no bad blood between anybody, so. Hope you enjoy the time lapse. Hope I don't bore you. <sighs> My work buddy could use that, Griff. You can lay, I get it, but I'm gonna need to see that in a little bit. It's so hard to work at home. Downstairs editing, and he just wants to hang out with dad. You guys bored? Are you? All right, so I'm going to be making coffee. I am a fan of the AeroPress because before Joel had her coffee bar hot chocolate station, it was single cup coffees only for me. So, this is my step by step process, so stay tuned. I don't know who cares to know this, but I use two filters. Oh, is it focusing? Two filters instead of one. I guess I only have my cat dad mug today. And I don't rinse, oh, and I don't rinse my filters because I don't think it makes that much of a difference, nor do I care. All right, break out the coffee grinder because everyone who likes coffee knows that fresh ground tastes better. Scale. Black Rifle Coffee Company member. 18 grams, 18 to 20 grams of coffee. Let's see, lost one. I try to do like a fine, because I know not all of it's gonna be like super fine, so like just grind the shit out of it. It'll be all right. All right, the only thing I don't like about this coffee grinder is it makes a mess. So Santa, if you're watching, I could use another coffee grinder. Now we just wait for the water to get warm. I brew at 180 degrees. I think it just doesn't burn it. Some people like 200. <sighs> Plus then I have to wait forever to drink it. So 180, let it brew, wait five minutes. I'm good to go. All right, here we go. I look so weird in this lighting. Washing me out. First we pour a little bit in, cover everything up. Back on 180, keep warm, stir it. We're gonna wait 15 to 20 seconds. All right, fill the rest up right to the top. Quick stir. Now we can unplug that, and now we wait for about a minute. Time to push. Just plunge it down. Kind of just a little more pressure than just resting your hand on it. You don't need to push it down too fast or else it squeaks out the sides and it's hot, so. I have burnt myself once or twice. So everyone's wondering why I don't have a cute desk, kind of like Joel maybe. This is my great grandfather's. He built it, he passed it on to my dad. My brother had it for a little bit and now it's mine. So something that's pretty important to the family. Hey, Griffin. Griffin, can you be good? He's a child. Really? Joel, call Griffin. A little gray hair behind me. It's tough, you know, I'm balding, but I'm not gray. Right, cut that, please. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Talking. What did you say? Nothing. Something about you balding? No. Today's a busy day for Julia. What about Bob? I know, but like, no one's actually seen your like work day in your life. I already filmed a work I day. I thought you were gonna say no one really cares. <laughs> no, like, I don't want every vlog to be the same. And so I was like, hey, why don't we film some of your life? Uh, yeah, it's so exciting. I literally, I had like pretty much all the same footage that I'm gonna get today on Tuesday that mm -hmm. I was like, I don't wanna film all that again. I figured they'd be bored watching me work because Jolie is a client of mine. Yes, I am. It is officially my turn 
to take over the vlog today. Hello, I'm sure Bobby said this, but welcome to Vlogmas Day 9. Thank you to Bobby for getting me a little bit of footage. But I was like kind of stressed because I really need to get some work done. Like as soon as I finish this final video, I will have a weight lifted off my shoulder and it'll just feel so good. So I need to take a step back for a second from like Vlogmas and actually focus on work. I'm like so close to being done with that video. And then Bobby and I are shooting a wedding on Friday. Saturday and then um, that'll be it for the year so right now I have a call in 20 minutes so does Bobby usually I take them up in the office as you guys know but Bobby and I cannot like talk over each other so I'm down here in the kitchen I always send my clients a final questionnaire to kind of go over the schedule of everything that's going on during their wedding day like unique things that are happening during their wedding that I don't miss so I sent that to them that would have been two months ago and their wedding was supposed to be last month, but then they had to postpone it to this month, literally like a month later. So I have to go over all of that and make sure everything is still the same. So now I kind of have to type up some notes of what I want to go over on the call so that we're all on the same page for Saturday. I can't believe it's here though. It's actually a friend of mine's sister who's getting married. So I'm excited to see her. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Hello. Call went good. We figured out everything for Saturday. I'm ready. That's the last wedding of 2021. I almost said 2022, but I literally start back up on January 1st, but then I have like kind of a break for a couple months. So I'm gonna edit for a little bit and I'll talk to you guys soon. This is what I walk into. And this isn't just today, this is all the time. <laughs> He's like a parrot. Look at him just like licking his paw. I just realized it's four o'clock, which means oh, our lights. Hour. Oh, you're leaving in an hour? Oh, to go up to IUP. Yeah, but our lights outside turn on and like, 30 minutes the day is pretty much over and we really well i've been productive but i haven't really vlogged i feel bad but i mean there's other things i have to do there's other priorities did you put santa on his belly it is what time is it joel 440. 440. i'm leaving for indiana at five joel is working she's crushing it you're just hanging out buddy Cute. Just like his mama. Hey guys, so it's almost one o'clock and I obviously have not vlogged much today. Um, I honestly don't even remember what clips that I did get. This vlog will probably be very short, but I did have Bobby kind of try to show his little work routine. But obviously he's not used to like being like the main vlogger, so. He did a really good job with the outro yesterday though. I was so tired when we got home from Pittsburgh, I just like passed out as soon as we got home. I finished that video and I'm so incredibly happy with it and I am very excited to send it out tomorrow. I actually have three packages that I need to send tomorrow, so tomorrow's vlog will be a lot better, I promise you. Part of me is like, do I even want to upload this video? Do I just want to skip a day of Vlogmas? And I honestly don't and it's not because I don't want to skip a day, it's honestly because I like the fact that you see that not every single day in my life is going to be fun in December like I do have work to do this is my real life and I obviously have to take work seriously vlogmas is just a fun little thing that I like to do but yeah that was a long outro that no one really needed but I'm here to say good night and then I will see you guys tomorrow and definitely look for a fun vlog tomorrow so we have a lot going on so I'm very excited because it's also Friday and I need Friday to come so bad so I will see you guys in the morning goodbye Plastic Santa's pine scented candles up on the mantle It feels like winter time when you're singing from door to door